as the off season approaches, uh, I just wanted to update you on a couple of discs that have changed in my bag. Uh, first foremost, the Ballista Pro. Uh, when I first came out and I did the review of the prototype ones, I felt like they were just really stable and they didn't have a place in my bag compared to something like my Enforcer. Um, but really, it was me. It was the way I was throwing. And at the time that I reviewed, I wasn't throwing as much as I sh normally do. And so my arm speed just, and my form wasn't up to par. Um, but now, I'm feeling a lot better. And the Blister Pro is, was, and has been my go-to for the past few tournaments. It is that long straight shot, maybe a little bit of flex to the right, but I know no matter what, it's always gonna come back at the end. So Blister Pro, that's a new update in my bag. Little man actually bought that for me. Uh, another one, the Lucid X Trust Pass. Little man bought this for me too. Uh, like the Blister Pro, it, it's got a similar flight except this stays straighter longer. And it's, I'm really working it in on a sidearm. I really love sidearm defenders, but this one is starting to feel really good on a sidearm for me. We'll see how it goes in the off season, but I really like it in straight, just straight shots where I want to keep my defenders more as a sidearm disc than a backhand disc, and that's why I'm work, working in a Lucid X Trespass. Explorers, I have a Glow Explorer and a standard Opto Explorer. Uh, these were as part of a player's pack in fully tournament, and I never really threw Explorers before, other than that review. The review was the same review I did the Ballista Pro, and again, uh, at the time, I was messing with a Convict. Really didn't think I had a spot in my bag. Well, they do. They're absolutely amazing, and it's actually kicked my Convicts out. I can throw these, anything I need to go longer, a longer truth. If I need to go longer truth and get that fade at the end, I can go to my Explorers, and they're absolutely amazing, and I love them. And finally, a lot of Latitude sticking, sneaking in the bag, but this, again, was at a fully tournament, part of the player's pack. Randomly threw it one day, and I was like, oh, I like this. This is a anchor. Uh, an anchor. Anytime I want something that needs to go left, I don't want to throw a fairway, but I needed to go left on a backhand, right-hand backhand, and sit. I'm going to anchor, and I'm really loving it for nice upshot sidearms as well. It's got a nice pl flat profile, and it's got the stability that even if I roll it over just a little bit, it's going to hold straight. All right, finally, it's not a disc, but my fiance hooked me up with two of these that go in the bottom of my Easy Cart. It is the coolers from Dynamic Disc. Uh, these guys have already come and saved me a headache and saved me hunger. They are coolers. They go in the bottom of the cart and you hold about five or six nice water bottles in here. I'll show you, you know, standard 16 ounce water bottles Woohoo! as I drop it. And I absolutely love them. It keeps them cold. Uh, it's not going to be, you know, Yeti cold, you know, but if you pack some ice in there, not a problem. Uh, it was so nice to have cold water and keeping like an apple, banana, ni uh, nice and cold and fresh during the round, I was able to just grow into my bag and grab them. And it was absolutely amazing. And I have a pair of these and they fit perfectly in the bottom of the cart. So I guess that's it. That's uh, the quick update on the bag. It's not changed much. Uh, a lot of latitude uh, plastic has snuck in there and there's nothing wrong with that. I'm throwing it really good and I'm really enjoying it. Uh, how are you going? How, how is your season? How, how's your bag progress? Anything new that's your new go-to? You get an old faithful kicked out? Let me know. Uh, let me know in the comment section. Look for always look forward to talking to you guys down there. And uh, as always, be better than yesterday. And take it easy, guys.